Quadrature LFOs are fairly uncommon in Eurorack. Their atypical functionality is almost never found in East Coast-style synthesizers. However, with the growing popularity and influence of additive synthesis and the West Coast approach, we are seeing more of these modules appear. Ornament and Crime includes a mode based on the Mutable Instruments Frames Easter Egg mode, with complex controls over the relationship between four LFOs. Quadrature LFOs usually output four LFOs of the same wave shape, each phase shifted by 90 degrees. Usually when this function is found in a module, the wave shape and phase relationships are preset. The Quadrateria mode in Ornaments and Crime takes the idea a step further, with a wavetable of shapes and assignable phase shift amount, among other things. In Quadrateria mode, outputs A through D each output one of the four LFOs. LFOs B, C, and D will always have a certain relationship to the settings made for LFO A, which we can edit in the menu. I'll route each of these outputs to one of four triangle wave oscillators, and route each to the mixer, so we can hear the effect of the LFOs clearly. In the top menu option, we can select one wave shape for the four LFOs. The next three menu options set the relationships of each LFO to the others. We can spread the wavetable shape assignment across all four LFOs to get completely different LFO shapes. Phase Frequency Spread function assigns the phase shifting of the four LFOs when set to the positive range. At the highest value, 127, the LFOs will be spread by 90 degrees in phase each, in the style of a traditional quadrature LFO. In the negative range, this function frequency shifts each LFO, changing the rate of each LFO in relationship to LFO A. This is a particularly uncommon function for quadrature LFOs. Coupling introduces phase modulation between the four LFOs, creating more complex shapes influenced by the other LFOs, especially if the wave spread is enabled. If we route these four oscillators to VCAs, we can control the amplitudes using the quadrature modulation to get an entirely different effect. Using the frequency shifted LFOs, other interesting and complex rhythms can be explored by combining or switching LFO rates. The additional menu settings can be used to change the overall frequency range independent clock divisions for LFOs B, C, and D, and exclusive OR logic operations for each offering still more options for distorting and mangling the shapes and relationships of the oscillators.
What are some other good uses for quadrature LFOs? Let us know how you're using them in the comments. Thanks for watching and sharing. As always, please like, follow, and subscribe. And remember, patch smarter.